six months since I've made a vlog. My mental health has not been great. Ever since uh, all of the events of last year that you can go watch if you feel so inclined. Um, I just really haven't felt like myself. And normally I can kind of bounce back after dealing with stuff like that, but it's just been really hard for me. Like, I feel like most of my motivation and my like excitement for life has been taken away because I basically just stayed home for a year and a lot of really like crazy things happened with my relationship and uh, just in my life and with people around me and I kind of just became a hermit. I haven't really been hula hooping, just don't really feel the urge to. Uh, I haven't been writing all that much. I actually quit freelancing because my concentration and um, motivation has just kind of been completely shot. Um, but that isn't to say that, you know, everything that's happened in the last six months has been bad. Um, me and my formerly ex-boyfriend uh, ended up working things out and getting back together and we've actually been weirdly doing better than ever but I do have some cool other good things going on too. Last month I wrote a story on Medium called How to Put Your Heart Into Your Writing and it like exploded. It got like close to a thousand views in less than a month which is pretty unheard of and I also was able to earn a $500 bonus from uh, Medium. It was like a one-time member bonus that they gave out to a thousand writers on the platform. And that was like, holy crap. Like I was scrambling to pay my rent and then I got a notification that I was getting sent $500 and I was just like, okay. <laughs> so um, I still have been writing, but I haven't been writing as much. I think that freelancing really just messed with my love for it. I just don't like writing for other people. I don't mind helping other people with their writing, like editing and stuff like that, but when it comes to writing things specifically for money, I just always kind of knew that that wouldn't be what I wanted to do with my life. Uh, it sounded to me a lot better than it actually was in reality. So, so yeah, I guess that's kind of pretty much it. I have any any real updates to add other than uh, I'm not living alone anymore which is nice because I was really not doing good I was hoping that I would be doing good but I wasn't doing a little bit better but I, I'm, I'm still really dealing with like a lot of new things that I haven't dealt with before I've never had major concentration issues I've always been really bad at procrastinating, like that's always been a thing for me, but concentration, I've always been able to kind of figure it out and get my focus on it, but lately I just, I literally just sit in front of the computer and like I'm not even entertained or even distracted most of the time, it's just like anything to not think deeply about 
of the things that are really bothering me. And that's not to say that, like, my life has been particularly difficult or hard in the last six months because it's actually been pretty chill. Like, things have been good for me. I haven't had, like, a lot of, like, outside forces really affecting me that much. And it's just kind of strange. Like, I feel like the internet age is just inducing ADHD in me, which is crazy considering I've been addicted to the internet since I was like 11 years old. I am on a new medication that has been helping my anxiety quite a bit. Um, it hasn't been helping with my motivation or energy levels very much, but um, I'm on something else that is helping me with my sleep, which should hopefully help with my energy levels. Um, I also really need to get back into exercising regularly especially now that it's warmer outside, I don't really have an excuse as to like why I can't go out and exercise or at least even just do something in my own house, which is pretty easy. I have weights, you know, like I have a yoga mat. I have things. Um, I, I just really feel like I need to impose some sort of like order and structure in my life. I actually was writing about that in my journal recently. How I just desperately need some structure. I think that uh, working from home has made me kind of like turn into a kid who's perpetually on summer vacation. Uh, and like inside my head, my mom is like, Sam, like you gotta do your work, you know, oh, your summer reading, whatever. And I'm just like, no, mom, I don't want to do work. But like, Y'all, I'm almost 30. <laughs> like, why? <laughs> like, at what point am I just gonna grow up and be like, okay, just just do the things that you need to do instead of avoiding it until you can't anymore. I don't know. So yeah, that was a little life update. <laughs> my kitten decided to come visit me in the midst of my speech. He's really been like, the best thing in my life in the last six months because he's gotten so big. I just can't even believe it. My little munchkin. <laughs>